goodbye in Korean. Annyeong! Annyeong! Hmm. Hello guys! This is Nina and welcome back to my channel. So today, I will be doing a review of the newest makeup products from BLK Cosmetics. So if you want to know my thoughts about these products, just keep on watching. BLK Cosmetics just released their newest makeup collection and this is the K-Beauty Makeup Collection. And we all know naman that Anne Curtis is one of the creators of BLK Cosmetics. So, alam natin na sobrang fan siya ng mga Korean, ganyan mga K-pop, mga K-beauty, and also in-incorporate nila yung team na yun sa makeup line nila. Which I think is a very brilliant idea kasi marami din sa mga Filipinos ang fan ng mga Korean. So, you can actually start with their makeup kit for beginners. So, um, worth 990 pesos. Parang it will include three products. So, meron ka ng BB and CC cream, may liquid eyeshadow, tapos meron ka ding lip and cheek tint. And that would also include a box na sobrang cute. I thought of buying that one, pero nung itatry ko kasi yung BB or CC cream, hindi ko nagustuhan yung tester kasi parang nag-melt na siya. Alam mo yung parang natunaw na yung BB or CC cream. So, hindi ko na talaga siya na-try. And I thought na if that is the kind of consistency of that particular product, I don't think that that would suit my skin kasi I am combination to oily skin. So, feeling ko that would be perfect for dry skin. Pero if okay naman siya para sa mga oily and combination skin, um, you can try that one also. But they just only have three shades of that. It couldn't cater to all skin tones. So, yun lang yung problem dun. Kaya, ang binili ko lang is yung dalawang products na I think I would um, really use for everyday. I got two products. First is this creamy cheek paint. And the other one naman is this all day lip and cheek tint. So, um, pareho pa sila na nakabox. They really improved a lot when it comes to packaging. I mean, yung packaging nila before, maganda na siya. It looks classy. Pero ngayon, parang so, since um, Korean team siya, ginawa nila siyang parang cute na packaging. Kasi ba diba, yung mga ibang mga Korean um, makeup brands like Etude House, ganyan. Sobrang cute na mga packaging nila. So, ganun din yung ginawa nila dito sa BLK. Unahin muna natin yung creamy cheek paint. So, ganito yung itsura ng packaging niya. Pink yung box with um, like a black on the side, tas parang may strawberry siya, kasi nga strawberry shade yung nakuha ko. They have two shades of this one. They have peach and strawberry. So, we have here the BLK, and then um, creamy cheek paint in strawberry, and then uncomplicated beauty. Kumbaga, yun yung tagline nung um, makeup line nila. On the other side, nakalagay yung instruction on how to use it. It says that using the soft uh, lip tip applicator, dab a small amount at the apples of your cheeks and blend with your fingers. And then, nakalagay din yung ingredients. Tapos, on the other side naman, um, uh, nakalagay na it is made in Taiwan. It has a net weight of 5 ml and it is cruelty free. So, yay for BLK Cosmetics for um, creating products that are cruelty free. And... Um, sa other side, nakalagay. Ang cool kasi nakaprint talaga yung price ng product. So, this one costs 349 pesos. At the top of the box, nakalagay yung um, shade, which is strawberry. And then, parang may nakalagay din sa taas na parang Korean na text. And feeling ko, yun din yung shade nun. So, the product looks like this. Parang mukha nga siyang yung lip and cheek tint eh, na color black. And then, uh, meron siyang color pink dito. So, if ang binili mong shade is yung peach, color peach naman to. So, dun mo determine kung anong shade yung product. I think this is very simple packaging, pero maganda siya. Nagandahan ako sa itsura niya. Ayan. Open natin siya. It has a very big um, applicator. Kaya, kailangan dahan-dahan ka lang maglabas. Kasi, Kapag binigla mo siya, ma matatapon yung ibang products. The applicator looks like this. Ayan. Sobrang wide niya. So, mukha siyang parang kasing lapad ng finger mo. So, the purpose of that is para kapag nag ka ng just one, it would be enough for 
your cheeks. So, that's the purpose of this one. Try muna natin siya at the back of my hand. So, maglalagay ako. Itadab ko lang. Yan. Actually, parang madami na nga yan eh. And then, just blend it. Ayan. So, it will look like that. Feel ko na parami yung lagay ko. Kung gusto mo na light lang or yung parang natural lang yung blush mo, kahit konti lang yung ilagay mo, okay na. So, I will apply this on the cheeks. Kung paano ko siya swinatch kanina sa kamay ko, ganun lang din yung gagawin ko. Tatap ko lang siya sa apple ng cheeks ko. Ayan, and then just blend it. Dali lang niyang i-blend, ah. Ayan. Parang nakukulangan ako sa color, so dadagdag pa ako. Pero hindi ko na siya ibabalik kasi enough na yung nakuha ko from the applicator. Ayan. So, medyo mas madami na siya. Kasi gusto ko pink na pink yung cheeks ko. Ayan, naparami ko na nga. So, naglalagay na lang din ako dito para mamukha siyang drunk blush. Oo, ayan ko talaga yung cheeks ko para magmukhang parang Korean. I actually love the color, pero parang um, dalawa lang kasi yung kulay. So, parang nakakabitin yung kulay or yung shades nitong creamy cheek paint nila. Sana nagdagdag sila ng mas marami. This is how the product looks like on my cheeks. Actually, gusto ko yung shade ng strawberry. Ang ganda ng pagkakapaint niya. Ayan. Um, it has like a dewy finish since uh, liquid yung consistency ng product. Pero kung gusto mo na maging matcha, you can set it with a powder. Since sa mga Koreans kasi yun yung mga gusto nila eh, parang mas healthy looking kasi kapag ganyan yung uh, itsura pag dewy effect siya. Hindi ko na siya isa-set. So, as is na lang yan. Ganyan na lang gagawin ko. So, next naman is for the um, All Day Lip and Cheek Water Tint. So, water tint pala siya. Parang similar lang din siya with the cheek paint. Um, it comes in this box. Pero ito, mas light naman siya. Parang super subtle pink yung color niya. And then, it says BLK Cosmetics All Day Lip and Cheek Water Tint. And meron din siyang parang Korean na text. I got one in the shade Cherry. Pero I believe they have four shades of this one. They have pink, red, orange, and cherry. So it has the instructions on how to use. It says that just apply a small amount on the apples of your cheeks and quickly blend with your fingers. For a gradient lip, dab a small amount on the center of the, of the lips and blend outwards with your finger. Apply more for a full lip. Diba? Kasi sobrang sikat yan sa mga Korean. Yung parang gradient lip. Diba? Parang sila yung nagpauso ng ganyan eh. And then, on the other side naman is yung claims ng products na to. And this, again, um, is also cruelty-free. So, at the top, nakalagay yung shade, which is cherry. And again, it comes with the Korean text na feeling ko cherry din yung ibig sabihin niya. Let me know, guys, kung tama ba. It has a net weight of 2.15 grams. And nakalagay din pala yung manufacturing date sa box niya mismo. It retails for 249 pesos. Ganito yung itsura niya. So, meron siyang clear na bottle. So, BLK Cosmetics. And then, meron siyang black na cover. And then, sa ilalim nakalagay yung shade. Tapos, parang ang laki masyado nung, nung cup niya. Parang mas malaki pa yung cup kesa yung mismong lagayan ng product. The applicator looks like this. Yan. Very flat siya. Hindi ko alam kung kita siya. Pero sobrang flat talaga niya. And I believe this one is bendable too. Yeah, this is bendable. Ang cool. Ayan no, pwede mo siyang mabend. Para pag in mo siya sa lips, talaga masusundan niya yung shape ng lips mo. So, try mo na natin siyang iswatch. Ito siya dito. Ooh, so yan yung color niya. Actually, mukha siyang red. Yeah, it looks 
na cherry naman. Water-based nga talaga siya. Sobrang liquid din niya. Tapos, try natin maglagay ng konti. Tapos, i-blend natin para if gusto nyo to for the cheeks. Parang hindi siya masyado nagka-color pag dinag-blend. Sobrang light lang. Sobrang light lang ng color. Compared kapag ang ginamit mo is yung cheek paint. Ayan. This is the uh, lip and cheek water tint. This is the cheek paint. So, you will see the difference. Right now, I really have dry lips. So, makikita natin kung magsisit in ba siya sa dry areas ng lips ko. Wala pa ako nilalagay, ah. Hindi ko pala nasabi kung may scent siya. Actually, meron siyang scent na fruity scent. Yeah. What I like about this one is it applied evenly on my lips. So, hindi siya uh, naiwan sa center ng lips ko, which usually happens when you use um, lip and cheek tints. This one, no. Medyo may pait siya onti. Pero kung careful ka naman sa pag-apply, at saka hindi mo titikman yung lips mo. Hindi mo naman siya malalasahan. Ito yung hinahanap ko sa mga ano, sa mga lip and cheek tint. Yung hindi nagsaset sa gitna. Kasi parang mostly talaga ng mga natry kong mga tints. Nagsaset sa gitna kaya hindi ko din nagagamit. Pero ito, okay siya. Let's now proceed with my final verdict about this products. So, let's start with the packaging. For the packaging, really thumbs up for that. Kasi uh, they were really uh, able to make you feel that Korean vibe on their packaging. Feel mo talaga Korean product yung ginagamit mo. So, thumbs up ako doon. They really did a good job in um, recreating their packaging to fit their theme of K-beauty collection. For the packaging lang of this one, yung applicator medyo, um, yun lang siguro yung con na makikita ko for the packaging kasi ang laki niya masyado so ang hirap niyang tanggalin sana, kung sana medyo mas maliit lang siya or kung sana siguro mas malaki pa yung bottle para pag tinanggal mo siya madali lang, hindi ka mahihirapan okay na siya sa akin, okay na yung packaging nito pero yun nga lang, mahirap lang talaga siyang tanggalin uh, for the formulation of the products to be honest, nagustuhan ko sila pareho. Um, for the cheek paint, gusto ko na sobrang pigmented niya. Isang dab mo lang ng product sa cheeks mo. You're good to go for that natural looking blush. But it's actually buildable and it's easy to blend. Yun yung gusto ko. Sobrang dali lang niyang i-blend. And it will give you that healthy glowing skin. Ang parang alam mo yun, parang di siya mukhang blush on. Alam mo yun, parang talagang uh, skin mo siya. So, I really like that. For this one, nagustuhan ko yung lapat niya sa lips ko kasi hindi siya nagbuo-buo. Hindi siya nagset considering na sobrang dry ng lips ko right now. Pero, ang ganda pa rin niya. So, gustong-gusto ko yun. The only downside naman of this one is the taste. It's kind of bitter. Pero, hindi naman siya something na nakaka-bother for me. For the price naman, um, to be honest, it's on the pricier range when it comes to local products. Kasi, kung ikukumpara mo siya sa mga ibang local products natin here in the Philippines, medyo pricey talaga siya. Ito, 349 pesos. Ito, 249 pesos. So, parang for a cheek paint ba, would you spend 349 pesos? So, syempre, yung iba, iisipin na pricey siya. Pero for me, ha, personally, yeah, it's okay with me. Kasi, konti lang kailangan mo, you can already see the pigmentation, yung color payoff niya. So, okay lang naman siya for that price. For me, ha, for me personally. For the lip and cheek uh, water tint, for 
Although medyo pricey pa rin siya for 249 pesos. Pero again, personally, okay lang siya. Hindi pa ako nakakahanap other than this ha. Hindi pa ako nakakahanap ng ibang lip and cheek tint na mura na ganito yung itsura niya sa lips. So, so far, ito nagustuhan ko. Pareho sila actually nagustuhan ko. Would I recommend it? Of course, yes. I would recommend this one. The performance for the quality of the product, I would recommend this too. This too. I, I didn't try yung other products nila from the K-Beauty Collection. Pero for these two, yeah, you can go with these products. So, yun lang. I hope you like this video. If you do, just give me a thumbs up. And if you're not yet subscribed, please do subscribe on my YouTube channel. And I will see you in my next video. Bye! Annyeong! Guys, it's already 3 a.m. It's already 3 a.m. Pero hindi pa ako makatulog kasi nakatulog ako kanina. Galing kasi ako ng practice, ng sayaw. So buong araw yung practice namin from 8 a.m. to 5 p.m. Tapos, nakauwi ako mga 8. Tapos, naligo ako, inan kumain ako. Tapos natulog ako ng 9. Nagising na ako ng mga 12. Kaya medyo hyper pa ako kahit madaling araw na. So,